What's going on guys? We're back with Mushoko Tensei episode 8. Last time we had more of a chill episode, we got to see Eris, you know, practice for her ball dancing, I guess, in front of a uh, for her 10th birthday in front of this whole crowd. And it was pretty nice. We got to see her and Rudis dance. <laughs> Rudis being a perv as usual. And uh, it was a pretty nice episode, so building more relationships. We also got to see a letter from Roxy, I believe, that was last episode too. And his prince being really pervy, you know, doing the tongue action. And uh, Roxy wasn't pleased. But it's built up to be really nice. We saw this thing in the sky at the end of the last episode too, after the granddaddy was cleaning up uh, one of the beast animals, I guess. So that was also weird to see. Anyway, we're on episode 8 now. There's four episodes left, because I believe we're getting 11. Um, I'm not sure what I'm expecting. If it's going to kick off, like if we do get a kick off, I don't know what type of direction the series will go on from now on. But let's get into episode 8. <laughs> He likes studying all these new languages, pretty nice to see. Ooh, Glennon! Oh, Arizona going going at it still! Oh my god! Clean animation. This one's a bit more of a calm one. It's not like we're getting scenes, but we're just getting... You know, scenes from the village, or the, the town even, of just raining, so... That's also a nice sight. We still get a bit of screen time. Ah, Rudis is gonna turn 10. Okay, I think so. It would be his 10th birthday. Mm. Oh my god, what a pub. <laughs> yeah, it was his 10th birthday then. That's really nice. I'm not sure if he said, like, many people celebrate his birthday. Mm. Huh? Oh, wow. Oh, oh, okay. That's it then. So it's not that then. What would it be then? The mom just looks down on him. I really want to see them communicate. And she's stacked though. Oh, wait, so we did all of them in two years. Wow. Kalein is passing it off like nothing's going on outside. Mm. <laughs> Could we talk a bit more? Kalein's so cute. Oh my god. Oh god damn! My god! She got the muscle pop! My god, Galen! Galen, you strange woman, no one the pool did shit to you. It's hard. Oh my god. That shit's funny in itself though. <laughs> <laughs> Put Rudas in charge. My god. <laughs> oh, that shit's too funny, man. Maybe a little bit, Rudy. Maybe a little bit. Mm -hmm. Aww. Damn. We don't get to see the reunion yet, I guess. Mm -hmm. Oh! Wait. What? Oh! Oh yeah, the bombs are taken away. <laughs> Wait, what? What happened? The sudden change in four. I thought she hated them. I have no clue. Maybe the maybe the acting affected her too. Oh, that looks sick. I'm not even gonna lie. God damn. Yeah, I wonder how much it did cost. God damn. I mean, they're a rich family, so hmm. Look, <laughs> collate at the back. God damn. Even granddad's happy, that's nice. I someone has to explain the mom to me. Did the acting affect or something? Because I really don't know. That's a tradition, wow. God damn. Ah, so she hated Rudis, I guess, for that. Mm. I would have thought so, yeah, damn. That sucks a little bit. I guess anyone would feel the same in that situation. Yikes. Twitter about to blow up, I guess. He seems intent on it. Hmm. This boy is definitely getting tied up somehow. I'm worried about this. The dad has just like so many weird motives and I don't know what his uh, plan is, I guess. Oh god, Twitter. Oh, Twitter. Oh no, please. Twitter ain't gonna end well. Oh no. Some people ain't gonna let this slide. 
Oh no, this ain't good, boys. This ain't good at all. I don't know what to say, like, I don't know what you would want me to say, I, I guess I have to sit here. Hey, yo, my god, this guy just fucking torn it up and threw it. Oh, Jesus, God, please, someone help me. Oh, god damn, wombo combo. Oh. Wow. God damn, uh, this man would have died either way. My god, if it wasn't his birthday. Damn, we haven't seen Sylphie in a while. Is she just waiting his return like that? Mm -mm -mm. God damn. Oh, Paul? Oh, wow, we're actually getting more discontent with them then. God damn. This is Rudy's little sister? That's so cute. Oh, I like her hair. Oh, she's training to be a maid too? Oh, it's the holy re boys! It's the holy relic. <laughs> yes, yes, boys! <laughs> the holy relic. Oh my God, that's funny. It's that thing in the sky, isn't it? Oh my God. Yeah, bet. Roxy Chan. Oh my God! How old's Roxy now? She would be. Actually, I don't even know her age. To be fair. Hmm. Oh, the city looks beautiful. Who would this be? Oh. Oh! Oh god damn, that dragon be ripped! It's the one of the heroes, they mentioned the one who slayed the dragon. He just took a full breath from it, my god. Well, who is this? God damn. Shit heating up. Dark Emperor, wow, okay. Who are these people? My god. What magic is that? Jeez, we're about to. Shit's about to go down, my god. Jesus. Oh, I'm fucking worried, because what are these people gonna go investigate this shit? Wait, what's happening? Oh. Oh, we get in a fight now? Oh! How fast is this dude? Galay can't even go against him. Oh! What is false, huh? She, he's just gonna leave now? What suspicion? The hell is going on? Oh! We're gonna end the episode like this? Oh, the lane! Oh my god! <laughs> my Jesus. Um, I got no words. I got no words. I got no words. Um, crazy episode. Uh, um, uh, wow. So we saw a lot of things, I guess. Um, let, let me wrap my head around what just happened first. Uh, it's okay, it was Rudy's 10th birthday. You know, we saw new celebrations, I guess. Rudy really got a pervy in the bed. I don't know what to say about that. But towards the end, we saw the thing acting up in the sky. We got to see Paul again, Zenith's family, uh, the other grey rats. And, you know, everyone's growing up. Sophie taking care of, like, you know, visiting. So she's happy now. Probably got over it. Rudy's getting the holy relic. If he gets a holy relic, Roxy said this also thing was in the sky. Could it be Rudy's? Maybe she knew, like, he was some type of powerful mage like that and he's causing it but now this thing wiped them like is it gonna take them to somewhere else like another world maybe not another world but like teleport them somewhere because i honestly have no fucking clue what's going on like this shit is insane like honestly like some people i've got no words <laughs> um that, that's what i could say it was an amazing episode uh i really don't know what else to say Besides from, <laughs> I hope no one's dead. First of all, Rudy's staff seems really OP with like just a little bit of mana could do that. So if he actually did cast 
Good of the Nimbus, I believe it's called. Um, everyone's about to be wrapped. Saw a bunch of new people. The hero, I assume it is, uh, above, I don't know, like, because he just took a dragon shot. His scales on him, and then we saw some demon god, I guess. She said she was. She had horns, little lolly. And then we saw that guy who didn't attack Elaine because she stated she was the Sword King, so. Crazy shit. I can't wait for the next episode. It's gonna be fucking crazy from here on out, I guess. And we've only got, like, fucking, what, eight, nine, ten, three episodes left. Wow, okay. <sighs> Well, if anyway you enjoyed, give your boy a like and sub. We're trying to get to 100. Follow my Twitter. We can interact there. Leave a comment. You know, I love reading them comments. Maybe you join me next time. Sensei out.